Oh, hey everyone. Uh, glad you could join me again. I'm just here checking out my corn. See, it's tasseled. And it's pollinated good. And down here we have some ears that are starting to come out. Yeah, see the ears are coming up. Of course, it is now taller than I am. <clears throat> I was starting to put an ear out there and there. Uh, of course, that ear looks pretty good. So, a few weeks. Listen here, it's just starting to tassel out. So here in a few weeks, I'm not sure exactly when, there will be corn coming in. I can't remember, remember the variety uh, that I planted, but it's looking pretty good anyway. I'm really surprised this is the first year that I've actually had success with corn. It doesn't usually do this good. It usually grows up to about two foot and then it dies, returns yellow or something, but this has just been really excellent. Like I said, you can see it's taller than I am. And the tomato plants. If you can remember the last time I showed them, they were probably, you know, a foot tall, somewhere along in here. I got my hand about a foot off the ground. Uh, they were a little spindly. Now you see they're covered in blooms and loaded with tomatoes. Uh, here, you see that there's some that's pretty fair sized. A lot of them are still small like that, but they will grow, which they will be coming in in a few weeks. And if you remember the beans, the rabbit ate them. I practically destroyed them. Uh, they just kind of got bushy, and that was about all that, that they did. They just grew up. Of course, the potatoes wound up with about 20 pounds of potatoes out of it, and the turnips. We ate all the turnips. There's plenty of greens left. And the cucumbers, uh, this will be ready in a day or two. Uh, it looked like the plants should be a little more bushy than this, but they're covered in blooms and they're doing well, so I'm not saying too much. And of course there's a, oh, yeah, there is the party guilty of eating the beans. Yeah, I see you. Yeah, you ate my beans. But the cucumbers are doing really well. And zucchini puts out several a day. And there's one right there. And there's one here there's three or four on this plant so yeah I mean these are just uh, been a real success big ugly looking bushy plant but they've been a real success and one more thing that I want to show you is the carrot bed. This is the first time that I've raised carrots, but you see there's one sticking out of the ground. Uh, there's two of them sticking out of the ground. And if you look, there's, you know, this, this whole bed is loaded. Like I said, there's not many of them because I did not know how they were due and I just 
got a pack of seed on a whim and so far they've done pretty good well anyway I thought that I would come out and show my garden as of June 25th 2012 and I doubt of course when it's towards the end of July um, when it starts getting cool turnips will be going in again and there'll be more peas planted the peas they have all died off died back so they were pulled and they done real well also and it's still quite hot sunflowers Hmm, there was a bee in there. How about that? Oh, all right. Well, there's my garden as July 25th, 2012. Well, uh, thank you for watching.